Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Chances are, by now, you've messed around with Linux, and Linux has most likely messed around with you, and if you've messed with Linux, then you've probably found yourself sitting in a mess. Not necessarily in your pants, but on your desktop. Because unless you know what you're doing, it can be a, well, it can be a real mess. So, they make distros for you to download, either VMware appliances, potentially a pen drive Linux, something that would uh, run on a flash drive, a USB stick, uh, even live CDs. Uh, but these distributions are usually built by other people with different needs, different ideas than you. You would want to try Linux, but you would want certain things in that distribution and not other things. So you'd want to build your own distro. Good luck with that. <clears throat> no, seriously, good luck with that. And it's real easy to do if you head over to SousaStudio.com. Now, that's not the old song, you know, from Genesis. Susa Studio. Oh. Now she don't even know my name. Susa, you know, the distribution, S-U-S-E Studio.com. Uh, you go there, register, and then you start building your own Linux distribution right there on the web. Uh, I've got a couple screenshots, of course, you could look at. Oh, look at that. Oh, search for software. I want to build the appliance, and I want to have this as the background, and I want to have this as the startup, and I want to have this as the logo. That's easy. Uh, and I want to go and test drive it to make sure it's going to work okay. That's what it's going to look like. This is the way I want the Windows to look. Okay, great. And yes, look at this. The supported formats, live CD or DVD, VMware image, hard disk or USB image, or Zen instances, if you want. They give you a you know a basic run through. You're essentially building your own Linux distribution on the web. And the nice thing is, is once you build your distribution of Linux, you can then share it with the rest of the world. Because that's how Linux works. Did you know there is a, I believe it's a, 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 what, a Hannah Montana? Is that, is that the name? Uh, there's a Hannah Montana distribution of Linux. Hannah Montana has her own freaking distro of Linux. What's your excuse for not Having it, not for not knowing what a Hannah Montana is. Last Hannah I knew about was a Barbera. That was that's where I got off the bus there. It's a short bus. You want to talk about a mess. Sousa Studio. Oh, no, dot com. Build your own Linux distribution. I'd be interested in seeing what you guys build out there, especially if it happens to be a, a VMware image. Uh, I, I can take a VMware appliances and run them in VMware Fusion on my Mac desktop with a great degree of ease. Uh, if someone wants to build a distribution of Linux that is just geared towards... Um, whatever. Let me know. My email address, chris at perillo.com. Uh, you know, honestly, the sky is the limit... Well, I mean, yes, you have some limitations, of course, but I'm saying you, you just let your imagination run wild, just not too wild, because then you kind of cross the threshold of kind of cool to, holy cow, please stay away from me. We have a community of tech enthusiasts, including plenty of Linux users at geeks.perillo.com, and we also have this chat room. It's open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. We are typically talking tech at live.perillo.com. We'll see you later.